What's going on guys and welcome back to Flash Jackson Road to the Show. No, Flash Jackson is not dead. He just went on a short vacation or like a three week vacation I think. I don't remember the last time I posted an episode. It was probably earlier this month. And so I'm getting around to it again. I mean I didn't forget about the series or anything. I want to continue it. But I've just been really horrible at MLB 12 to show ever since it came out. So I, I got on a couple weeks ago to play some Flash Jackson. I played like three games and I struck out like 75% of my at-bats. I could not hit anything in the contact I was making was like two hoppers to the second baseman. Just uh, ground ball to the first baseman. I was just like, where is the good contact? When is it going to come? Because I've gotten my contact ratings in the upper 60s now. I've been working on my attributes, but how come I'm not seeing a noticeable amount of improvement? As a matter of fact, there seems to have been a drop-off in Flash's play as of late, especially after the hot start to the year. I thought he actually had a realistic shot of batting the high 200s this year and perhaps making it to the MLB by the All-Star break or at least some point during the season but then things just went back to how they always had been. I was batting in the low 200s you know 220, 215, 210 and now in this last game I played here I got hurt. I put him on the 15 day DL and then I put him on the 15 day DL once again so he was fully healthy and then I brought him back and so I've just been looking for what is the spark I need that's going to get me going. I mean in this episode what I wanted to do was I wanted to change up my hitting approach a little bit because as Albert Einstein said Said, doing the same thing over and over again expecting different results is the definition of insanity so all I ever do is I guess inside fastball and so I wanted to change it up I'm still guessing fastball because I'm really horrible at hitting and I want to be able to know at least what kind of speed I can expect the next pitch to come at me is going to be but I wanted to start guessing in different zones and trying to make maybe hit the ball the other way and get better at making contact no matter where the ball is in the strike zone I gotta be able to hit it if they throw strikes and so I wanted to start guessing up in the zone and away pitches sometimes not just inside although I love those inside pitches those where I get a lot of my extra base hits and most of my average probably comes from pitches in that zone but I also take a lot of pitches that are up in the zone and they're very hittable and just pitches that are right over the middle of the plate because I have a lot of trouble picking up pitches in this game and so I've been playing on all-star difficulty I mean it shouldn't even be that hard it's like the third difficulty out of five and I've just been I've been really patient with it because I'm just thinking you know my attributes are gonna get better I'm gonna really improve eventually that will be hitting 300 and I'll be happy in the major leagues hopefully and uh, well that fairy tale ending or that fairy tale storyline has not come to be because it's just been so much struggling over the first three years the average has been horrible I know you guys want me to bump down the difficulty I don't want to play on varsity because I like the challenge but I don't think I should be sucking as much as I actually am sucking I mean I know I'm not that great at the game but I've had over 800 at bats with Flash Jackson and I haven't noticed much improvement so I'm here in batting practice I don't know how I got selected for the Futures game I'm playing horrible and there's just no good contact coming from this batting practice session not even BP fastballs can I hit solid right now it's just been this is the biggest role if you can't hit BP you gotta get off the game because that's why I stopped playing before I couldn't even hit in BP a couple weeks ago then I was striking out I just put the game away I'm like no this is not gonna be an episode right here I'll pick up the game later I'll play better and hopefully I can give these guys some more flash jacks and entertainment because I love playing this series for a while but lately it's like I'm sucking so bad at the game I'm not even having that much fun but in this episode I actually did hit a couple deep fly balls which was nice to see I mean I'd take that over a two opera to the shortstop or one of those other ground balls I hit all the time so we're here in the bottom of the third inning one one pitch flash fouls this one off and I'm just trying to get some solid contact and this pitcher here he's pretty good and the one two pitch that slider away I can't hit the slider away guys I mean this game I was playing so bad I'm like there's no way this is real the game has to be rigged for me to be playing this bad you know what look what I found out I'm like how did I miss this slider watch this replay guys I didn't miss it the ball literally travels through the barrel of my bat it's in the sweet spot I should be able to at least pop this one up I made contact right there that should be a pop out right there I should not strike out that should be a pop out I should get like two points for it so I was really frustrated at that I was gonna play the rest of the game though and then this fastball I'm like there's no way I missed it this game is out to get me look at this replay look at this replay it goes right directly through my bat. I can't hit it any more perfect. Well, it's not really up on the up on the barrel and far enough, but I at least should have hit it into the field of play, and who knows where it would have gone. Look, right through my bat. The game is rigged, guys. They do not want Flash Jackson to succeed here on MLB 12 The Show. What do I do when a game 
hates me like this. Look at that. We have a baseball sandwich in the barrel of my bat. This is just ridiculous. So I don't know what I can do to fix this issue. I don't even know how long this has been going on because I just started checking the replays on that because I'm like, I, I'm fed up with this. How is this even possible? So, you know, I think next episode... I'm changing Flash Jackson's batting stance, and I'm going to see if we can get some change around here because Flash Jackson needs some change because MLB 12, the show, is rigged. The ball goes through my bat. They're throwing hologram baseballs at me. That's why I'm striking out so much and having a poor average. So thank you guys for watching. Be back with Flash Jackson next time with a new batting stance, and hopefully Flash Jackson starts to hit the baseball. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.